On 4-7 Day, something remarkable happens when we come together as a community to celebrate the work we do, the volunteer work we do, the service we do, all of the effort we put into making not just this community, but communities around the world stronger. I kind of like to think of it a little bit as a diamond. It doesn't matter the number of facets. It matters the symmetry, the sparkle, and the brilliance. And when we find that symmetry and sparkle and brilliance on our campus, it means that the things that we do in the world beyond our gates can be truly transformative, can blaze bright and be a beacon for not just the liberal arts, but what it means to be an engaged human being today. This class, the class of 2019, is full of sage hens getting ready to fly. One of them is our ASPC president, Alejandro Guerrero Vargas. He has worked this year in an extraordinary partnership with the city of Pomona, where he has been documenting through oral history, through film, and other media, the change-making activities and actions that have helped to shape the world around us. We have other great sage hens. Sophie Rowe has been doing extraordinary work through our Draper Center for Community Partnerships, where her focus is on hunger and homelessness. She has started Pomona Employment Partners that provides drop-in service on a weekly basis to homeless shelters throughout our region, enabling our students to have a direct impact on the lives and futures of those who live among us. One of our most extraordinary alumna, Merle Evers Williams, gave one of her last public speeches here at Pomona last year. She sparkles like a hot and fiery diamond, telling the story of what civil rights meant and has meant for America, whether it was through her service as the head of the NAACP, through the books she has written about civil rights, through the very testimony of her life. She has helped to change the United States of America for the better. She is a sage hen like a phoenix through the sky. When we think about all of these extraordinary things our students, our alumni, our faculty, our staff have done and do today, it's incredibly inspiring. And I hope that this four seven day, it enables all of you to ask and answer the question, what will I do in my community to transform it for the better? Have a great four seven.